Empowerment to Knowledge and Serena Stone present the Tequila Drinker's Guide to Health and Wellness radio show with your host, medical Qigong author, practitioner, and educator, Serena Stone, featuring the director of the Universal Healing Tao Medical Qigong System, Master Montak Chia. Hello and welcome back. We are here in beautiful Dao Garden. We are with uh, Grandmaster Muntak Chia. And what you hear in the background is about a hundred of Master Chia's students having a beautiful lunch in the dining hall here at Dao Garden. Uh, so you might hear some dishes because uh, very soon they're going to come and deliver Master Chia some lunch and we're just going to sit around and have a chat mm -hmm. today about a really beautiful practice called Wisdom Qigong. Uh, this is something that Master Chia has been teaching for how many years now? I mean, uh, 30, 40 years. 30, 40 years. <laughs> so you're probably pretty good at it. And by the way, welcome back, Master yes. Chia. Thanks for coming. Yes. <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm. So let's just get right into it. What is Wisdom Qigong and why do your students need to learn it? Um, in the Tao we said, um, it's just like uh, now we know that our car, we need to add in better fuels of energy. Okay? So um, you have a uh, two engine car, two, two, two engine machine, you add a very simple gasoline in order to run that machine. When you want a higher performance, uh, you need to refine. So we're putting in a car, so we divide many grade of gasoline. Lower grade, higher grade of gasoline. And that is the energy, the Qigong. Sure, the gasoline, gasoline has changed over the, the yes. years, right? And they said this one, if you use this, will be run, perform better, use lesser gas and lesser, uh, 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 of lesser uh, thing. So that is the what we call, so now Qigong have many levels, or energy have many levels, very low grade, middle grade, higher grade of energy. Now for us, to have, the brain actually use so much uh, energy. Is that why all your students are sitting there eating so much from your organic buffet? Because yes. they've been meditating and they're right. hungry? <laughs> and the, um, that is one of the major what we call by Wisdom Qigong. So now the first step, we, we know that the Tan Tian, the abdominal area, like a, like a refinery places. Yes. So when, and we, a basic energy that we have is we have original force. That actually is very high forces. But we have, um, we have the basic energy. We eat, we breathe, we digest food, Okay, so now in the Tao said, if you have a good simple food, for example, we said not much process, like five major color of vegetable, five major color of uh, fruits, five major color of meat, or we call the protein. So in this way, you have more better, better fuels. Okay, yes. that is a basic one. But the next one is that when they when we digest and become um, become the energy, now when it, when the gasoline come in, the nutrients come in, they combine with the original force to spark up and burn. Yes. And burn out energy. So that's the basic energy. So if we understand the tantian can help us refine the energy. And, uh, and uh, a lot of energy stored in the organs. And the Tao believe that information stored in the organ also, okay? So the brain actually uh, supplying so much energy from the internal organ and information and decision. That's what the Tao say, all can help us make decision, okay? First of all, we say the heart like the general commander, 
the leaves were like um, a, 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 a plan, a uh, counselor keep us thinking, planning, and, you, uh, and uh, controlling a lot of uh, mysterious things. Okay. Okay, that means all the information, the liver had, had to do it. And the spleen, we said, it just gave us a very important um, intention. Okay. Okay. And the lung gives us the emotional part. Okay. Yeah, all the seven per seven emotional. And the kidney gives us a very important part we call willpower. Willpower. So all these things is give us, make us, the brain get all this good energy and good decision and the brain can have bet make better energy. And the organ also, we know now the body have to supply energy to feed the brain. Oh, so not just from outside, we have to make the energy. Yes. So that's why the Qigong practice is beginning. You're taking energy, transform it. So you refine them into high octane energy with all the organ uh, information. So now we know that the organ like data is stored. Okay. And the brain like computer and, uh, and, and they have to get data to make decision. Okay. And if you get a wrong decision or not, uh, or, uh, but the brain, you see, our brain is only about 2% of our weight. Okay. Yeah, but you're using 25% of the energy. There's a lot of energy. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, so that's why it's what you're feeding, what you eat in, and what you practice, and what you understand, I can refine energy. That make a big difference. Okay. okay, so the wisdom qigong usually we we talk about smile to the organs and you have the emo good emotional is important. So all energy can turn, for example, the heart, if you have very hatred, impatient, hastiness, it's a very low energy. Yes. Compared to a love, joy, happy energy. Now, when we have a lot of negative emotional in the heart, angry in the liver, and a worry in the spleen. Now, if you have this emotional feedback to the brain, now the brain make a wrong decision. Okay? And that you have no wisdom. Sense. And yeah. you have no wisdom. So, so the lung, we said, sadness, depression, and you, you also, you're so depressed, so emotional, no way to make the, a, a decision on, you're not smart enough. You cannot think because you are so run by emotional, we call it negative energy. Okay. okay, so we make unhealthy decisions when we have imbalanced emotional energy. And, um, and so we call it very low grade energy. Low grade and energy. And eating bad food also. <laughs> because the, it's all these I things. I think there's a relationship the between yes. bad energy and bad food. <laughs> yeah, because, because that is how we, um, uh, uh, we, we say, how we get the negative energy. Okay, and it's funny because I'm sitting here with Master Chia and his uh, assistant just put beautiful colored mm -hmm. food in front of him. He would like to eat it, but he can't eat and talk okay. at the same right. time. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay, the show will be over soon. You can have some okay. lunch. So please, Master Chia, tell our people, your listeners, mm -hmm. what is Wisdom Qigong? How can they use your Qigong formula? So the, the first thing, you know, you started to learn how to smile to the heart and make sure you feel love, joy, happiness. You radiate out the love so we follow the fire element. You radi radiate out the love, joy, happiness to your spleen, pancreas, stomach. We call the earth element, fire creating earth. And from there you radiate out to the metal, the, the metal, the lungs. And so you bring so you go to, usually we start with simple, is the heart. It's very sim important because the heart is the seat of all emotional, okay? So now we, we radiate out the energy into the, into the uh, from the organ to the heart, from the uh, heart into the organ. Okay, from the heart into the organ. And now we can radiate them out into all the, uh, because if we generate love, joy, happy, now we can radiate them out to 
uh, make other organ also happy, have good energy. Now, every organ supplies certain information. That's what we believe. It store experience, it store all this kind of data in the organ. It's not only the brain. We think that the brain do everything. No. Without the organ, the brain cannot do anything. Okay. Without the, when we, when the people brain damage, they cannot do any decision. Right. But when the organ die, one organ die, we have to change organ. Yeah. Unless we can, otherwise, the organ gone, we cannot live. You know. Right. Mm. All right. So, uh, have you found, Master Chia, that when you teach the wisdom qigong? Uh, ha have you seen your students change? Have, do they become healthier? Do they become happier? Is it physical, emotional, both? Yes, the, the whole key, we, they, they all continue uh, study, like, like they have to go to the basic, which we go into the inner smile, how to inner smile and how to create a cycle, and how to multiply more energy in the organ, so your organ don't don't have too much negative energy. No, no, we can, we cannot make good decision with very negative energy or very bad food. We cannot do it. Okay, so we call if you want uh, 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 to run a high, high engine, you need a very high energy to run it. So that is so we we smite the organ one by one, and after that, we when we feel the organ have more energy. Now the dog believe that the liver supply energy into the right side, the heart more into the center, and the spleen pancreas supply more energy, and then data into the into the left side, and the lung more to the front, and the kidney more to the back. So that how this energy supply form the organs. So. When you, so, so your students are not just experiencing physical healing, but it's mental and emotional. I mean, what yes. you're talking about is everything. Yes. Just the, to be happier people. Everything is involved with everything, but they, they understand that they need to have, the energy is the, out, is the end of outcome of everything. Okay. Okay. So that's why when you burn some, some fuels, and some fuels give you energy lesser than the other fuel because the fuels involved with it, okay? And you're burning a rock, and you're burning a wood, and you're burning another better wood, or you're burning some kind of oil, it's different energy, okay? Well, I tell, I've, I've listened to many of your students uh, talk about their, what, what they'd like to heal when they come to one of your courses. Yeah. And one of the top things they talk about is energy. Like they get halfway through the day and they're so tired, mm -hmm. they have no energy. So it mm -hmm. sounds to me like uh, this, this very basic uh, meditation is going to address some you know a problem you're, you're mm -hmm. improving the quality of the fuel and they're becoming consciously aware that fuel even exists fuels because if feeding the most important part is the brain because the brain have to take all the energy and making decision so sometimes people don't understand that all of the brain the brain cannot run everything we have to need all the data from everywhere to to, to keep to the brain so when you have good energy feed to the brain, now you have more wisdom to do things. Wow. Yeah. All right. Um, thank you very much for that, Master Chia. Listeners, uh, I hope that you've enjoyed this interview, and I hope that it's given you enough good fuel for your brain, and maybe you will make the healthy decision to come and visit Master Chia during one of his world tours or come to Dao Garden in Thailand and study with Grandmaster Mantak Chia and learn. Learn how to create better fuel, learn what fuel is, understand your organs, and improve the quality of your physical, mental, and emotional health. He is here for you. So, Master Chia, thank you so much for joining thank us you. today. And listeners, we'll see you in a week or two. Thanks for listening. Bye. Thank you for joining us on another Empowerment Through Knowledge adventure. Want to learn more? 
find Master Chia at MontauKchia.com. That's M-A-N-T-A-K-C-H-I-A.com. Find more medical Qigong lessons, books, and information about studying directly with Serena at serenastone.com. S-A-R-I-N-A-S-T-O-N-E.com. Thanks for listening. If you like what you learned, subscribe today.